So I'm in my office right now and I've got the fabric right here that I just bought from Joanne Fabrics to make this superhero cape. So this is going to be a little instruction for all you parents out there that want to make an inexpensive cape for your kid for Halloween or you for some kind of a Comic-Con perhaps or, you know, some kind of a dress-up party. So this is all you do. It's super, super simple. You just take the, you take the material and lay it down. It's double. I bought, for me, I bought, um, it's like a yard and it's doubled over. So it's about six feet of material. I got this super shiny because I felt Bart deserved a super shiny cape. All you do is you fold it up about six, two inches right here. There's just a two inch fold of both sides. There's a big fold down here. So this is doubled over, see? And then you fold this up here. Take your scissors. And all you do is you start cutting. You cut about a one inch right along here, all the way down. Now, I already did this, as you can see. I'm not actually cutting it, but I already cut it. So you cut it so that you've got now, all along here, you've got these little slits, right? So now, what I'm going to do is open this up. Somehow I've got to do this. Okay. I'm going to open it up. See, just like that. Open the whole thing up. And I've got this grain ribbon. Grain means it's like, it's got this, like, fun texture. It's got a fun texture because it'll really grasp a hold of the, uh, the material. Garrett, can you come in here a second and hold this phone? Sure. This is Garrett. Hi, Garrett. Hi. He's one of my assistants. Here, hold the phone and like just follow me along as I thread this. So all I'm going to do is just thread this along like this. Right there. So now I'm just going to gather it all together. You can see what's happening. Okay, so there it is. There's the cape, and then as I put it on, it's way too small. <laughs> now I just pull this around like that, right? <laughs> and then I got the ribbon here to tie it, and it's awesome. Okay, so now that I've done this, you can make one too for yourself or for your kid for the holidays or what, uh, you know, some sort of comic convention in San Diego. Ta-da!